Hi Scorpio, it's L here to do um, what January 22nd to the 31st reading, the latter part of January. Um, thank you for being here. Comment, subscribe, uh, share the video. It's much appreciated. It's going to be for general messages for Sun, Moon, Rise, and Scorpio. So let's get started, okay? So we're going to start with love. What do you have to tell Scorpio for love? What's going on with Scorpio and love? Okay. Keep in mind, it's a general reading. It may not resonate with you. What's going on for Scorpio in career and finance? Career and finance for Scorpio. What can you tell Scorpio? Okay. Right. Oh, okay. We'll take them. Right. Health and well being for Scorpio. Health and well being for Scorpio. Okay, bottom of the deck. Nice. Six of Swords. Six of Spades. So this talks about someone making an active decision to um, make small achievements over burdens to move away from to assess a situation and find equality and balance in it definitely making a strides toward you fill in the blank okay um could be air sign gemini libra aquarius i'll leave that guys up to you to subscribe up astrological sign okay love and romance wow seven of swords seven of spades four of spades ten of pentacles or ten of diamond all right so what this says in love and romance is that for some of you you felt like you you had the perfect relationship it was like twin flame maybe even with air sign gemini libra aquarius doesn't have to be capricorn virgo taurus um there's been loss like you guys are uh, not together loss of friendship loss of this burden that was the relationship uh, there is a separation a need to heal to meditate to heal from maybe this in the separation it wasn't it wasn't exactly peaceful. Um, someone felt victorious over the other. Now this could be you, vice versa, uh, or the other person felt like they, they won that battle. They got over. Or, or Scorpio, someone is getting over you. Someone that you have a family with that you spent a significant amount of of time in your life with someone who you built you built up a situation with or who you're trying to build a situation with um, some of you are trying to heal this also trying to get back and try to heal you want to someone cut you out and you want to go back vice versa something of that nature we'll clarify over at the website Okay, so career and finance. Three of spades, nine of spades, eight of clubs, ace of clubs. Okay, so in career and finance, there will be um, maybe a separation, a divorce of how you earn income. It's bringing you a lot of anxiety. Some of you could be dealing with the government shutdown or something like that or Whatever this is or was, it's, it's trouble in a particular relationship due to jealousy and or greed. Um, you're concerned about your health, wealth, and happiness uh, because there is a significant amount of... You feel like something's at an ending. Like, 
uh, job is ending or you need to end you're right at the brink of um, you know you need to divorce or separate from a situation this is the the ending it's not the culmination of the ending uh, it, you're at right at the, the borderline of something ending things may be troublesome the interaction is it's in regards to trouble in this relationship it's in regards to the problems some of you may be trying to restore this this um Career and finance. You may be going through a divorce. This is causing you a lot of anxiety in regards to maybe how much money you'll have to pay out. There might be legal proceedings where things are are spoken about. Things come out. It motivates you to be concerned about health, wealth, and, and, and your happiness. Some of you got dropped. I don't know what that means. This might have been a layoff. Some of you are going to really try to cultivate something for yourself. Okay. Health and well-being. Nine of hearts. Two of diamond queen of swords. In your subconscious mind, in your feelings, in your desires, in your heart, you are without. You are missing. You are in separation from what you wish for. Make a wish. It very well may come true. This could be another person. This could be anything health and well-being related. You're, you're at the right at the culmination of the ten of cups the highest level of happiness you, you're missing one cup you're wishing a longing for that nines are about separation so you're not there's something in between you and the ten of cups right or ten of hearts you feel like this will bring you a lot of emotional stability um, what may be in between this is maybe a love affair a decision or a business decision that you're weighing up that may not be favorable in regards to maybe an air sign Gemini Libra Aquarius or something that you need to be truthful or clear about or someone who has cut you out you're wishing Scorpio hoping for you want this back but it may very well not be in your best uh, the best thing for you or vice versa is not the best thing for someone else we're going to clarify over at the my, uh, website do keep in mind that if this reading resonates with you to gain a bit of clarity is one dollar seventy five cents click the link below and you can um, get a more in-depth reading if you would like something just for yourself, go over to the website and book a personal reading. Take advantage of 10 off 35. That's $10 off of any reading, $35 or more in value. Let's see what the angel answers have to say for you, Scorpio. It's like Scorpio is trying to hold on to a family dynamic or uh, a dynamic that yields them some type of money. To let it go would be a payout maybe that Scorpio doesn't want to make or vice versa Scorpio is dealing with someone who feels that way wait yeah you I don't feel like you you love this person too but it's just it's just over forgiveness yeah that's what you want you or the other person you want forgiveness you very well may get it but it's also um What was I going to say? Um, you, okay, so you get forgiveness, but that doesn't mean you get what you want also. 
look for a sign. Okay. Butterfly Oracle Cards to skip three. What's your Scorpio be focused on moving forward? Okay, this flipped out. Realizations and epiphanies. So Scorpio, you're getting a lot of spiritual insight download uh, heavenly signs that is something isn't working or it's not going to work or you need to release and let go or someone needs to do this with you all right gracefully aging retirement all right, so yeah, you, some of you may be going into, of course, retirement. Or some of you may be retiring with that three of spades in the career and finance. Retiring an old way of making money, going into a new way. Maybe causing you some anxiety about doing this. Maybe ha You may have been forced into this. You know, like dropped or government shutdown or layoff or fired or needing more money. Whatever it may be, gracefully aging also talks about, of course, the outward appearance of aging. You know, we want to take care of our skin, ourselves, our body, uh, his, you know, therefore. But um, also it talks about the mental, you know, it talks about the emotional. Are you maturing? And what does that look like for you? Is there betterment for you in regards to... Uh, those two sectors in your life are you still handling situations um, of conflict or, or unresolved like you would when you were 20 years old 15 years old have you matured are you gracefully aging it's a question you want to ask yourself okay end of an era at the bottom of the deck for some of you something is ending we got two nines here Scorpio's holding on for dear life, or maybe somebody's holding on to Scorpio for dear life. Um, but it's it's over. And it was is very clear in the cards. Okay, if this resonates with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. I'll go over to the website, book a reading for yourself. Know that I am praying for you, pray for me as well. It's still January, so I'm gonna say happy new year, okay? All right, so take care guys.